You know, I don't ever remember a time when I didn't want to be a singer. I grew up with big, wide skies and sun most of the year, and all the year. And um, it wasn't that far, but it seemed like it was really far from the big city, you know, and I, I had a lot of big dreams. Growing up in East Texas, I only had church music and, and the country records that were at our house. So that's where all my music came from, was either the radio station where my dad played those records or singing with my mom. And you know, those records that my dad was playing, I thought, I'm gonna make these records and somebody's gonna play my records one day. sad country song. It's the beauty of it. It's an art. And, um, you know, you don't hear it that much anymore. And this area is just so rich with music, but it's all kind of roots music. You would have George Jones, and then you'd have like Lightning Hopkins. When you get this far down into deep east Texas, that's what you're getting. You know, you're getting music from, from over in Louisiana and Mississippi, and it ha had a huge effect on me musically. Uh -huh. Magnetic recording day. Ooh, so cool. I felt like I had to leave East Texas and go to Nashville years ago, but in my mind, my heart was always here and always, I was always coming back here. And I just told my husband when we got ready to make a new record, I said, this, the next record I'm making, I'm making in Texas. Time is fleeting. Sugar Hill was a studio that we had heard about for years and years. You know, Jones got those great vocal sounds. And maybe we'll just get a little bit of the vibe out of the walls and everything. A couple years ago, my entire career really shifted because I went from being on a major label to being on an independent label. Went from playing arenas and stadiums to playing small theaters and stuff, and it's just a much more musical experience. My favorite shows I've ever been to have been in smaller venues. There's just some pockets where some people, they just are like me, man. They just love that real traditional kind of 60s sound. And even the band was so excited about getting to play a show for people around here. We were on a group text earlier and they were saying, you know, we gotta do some Jones tonight with this crowd because they're, go they're gonna expect it. All right, so my favorite singer the whole time I was growing up was George Jones. So, <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do one of his now. passion for what I do and for, for the kind of music that I love so much. It's in there all the time and so when I get a chance to let it out, it just comes out like that. I never thought about, well, I need to make sure I sound like I'm from here, but this is home, you know. It, it's where definitely where I belong. I mean, I honestly think I was just born to sing country music, and thank God that's what I get to do. Yeah.